I'm looking forward to. I'm looking forward to. NYPD. NYPD. Helping me up. Helping me up. But don't you see? What don't you see? But don't you see? How wonderful! How wonderful! This looks! This looks! Look around! Look around! Take it in! Take it in! This is who we are! This is who we are! We have claimed this space! We have claimed this space! It's our space! It's our space! It's always our space! It's always our space! And even if you're standing up! Look at them! Look at them! Those are standing up! Those are standing up! We love you! We love you! We need your witness! We need your witness! Encourage us! Encourage us! Forward! Forward! Okay! Okay! A cop comes up! A cop comes up! Smiles at you! Smiles at you! Tells you to move on! Tells you to move on! You smile back! You smile back! We got involved with this in the beginning because we believed in uh, this call. We believed in, in the possibility of a better world, and I think there's a, every clergy here is willing to put down their body at some point or another and get arrested. Uh, you know, I'm a Christian, and I really believe powerfully in the message of Jesus. And his message was love and justice for everybody, not just for some. And when we institutionalize um, love and justice for just a few, it's against Jesus. So that's why I have to do this. So uh, I came down to Occupy Wall Street. I was with Occupy Faith. Um, we were kind of walking around. We did a few actions, and then I... Uh, I actually ended up being arrested at Broadway and Wall Street about 20 minutes of 10. Uh, a group of us decided that we were going to sit down there um, to make a nonviolent um, show of our resistance to empire, and we were summarily arrested very quickly. I voluntarily chose to be arrested because um, I'm a follower of Jesus. Jesus, in the last week of his life, uh, marched into Jerusalem with a group of people. He went down to the temple where all the money changers were and the rich folks, the seat of power, and he overturned the money changers tables with a group of his friends um, in action against, uh, against the powers of money um, hurting the people who are poor. So I went out um, in solidarity with Jesus and with everyone in the world who is poor today and being taken advantage of by the powers of Wall Street and the powers of empire in this country and this world. Well, I came out with Occupy Faith Group and I wanted to take a rest. I wanted to take a rest because it's important for me to speak up and stand up and sit down for things I believe in, which is for the people taking back control of our society, not corporations. So I sat down on the corner of Wall and Broadway and uh, the police guy said, hey, let me help you stand up. You don't have to be arrested. It's okay. And I said, no, thank you. I'm sitting down. Put on the damn cuffs. So they put on the cuffs, they made them just tight enough so they wouldn't fall off. It was like easy, and I was happy to be here. Being in jail was the best part of the whole experience because we talked with each other, we exchanged information, we exchanged stories, we learned from each other, we planned future Occupy uh, things that we might do, and I got to know a couple of people in Occupy Faith a lot better. We are talking, marching on the freedom train. Being in jail is an awesome experience, but I want to encourage other people like me who want to get arrested. If we get a thousand people arrested in a day, that's going to have impact. But middle class people might very well come out and be arrested if they know they just sit down, put their arms behind their back, get the cuffs, and spend a day in jail with some very nice people. But faith is about power, it's about resistance, it's about how we make stories, it's about what we, not just what we believe in, but what we have faith in. And what I have faith in is a God who is with the poor, who is with the people, and who wants justice and a, um, a reign in this world, a commonwealth of the people and of justice and of beauty and of truth. 
And that's what I think Occupy Wall Street is doing its little part in helping to bring that about. And I want to stand with that as much as I stand with Jesus and Christianity and anything else that is good and true and beautiful.